Howdy y'all, it's your host Rho, welcome back to Love of Games. We're going to continue our Tales of Sephora journey today, so please like, comment, subscribe, share the video, and tell me what you think in the comment section down below. We, uh, we're going to go do a few little side things, and then we're going to go back to Flanor and uh, see the doctor, and that should open up every side quest in the game. And it's also the turning slash endpoint of the game. So we're going to see what we can do in this episode. Have a wonderful day, and let's get back to it. Future of this kingdom. I wonder what the Pope was up to. Who knows, it's probably wanted to rule in place of the king. What a fool. Well, now that he's out of the way, I can relax a little. And the discrimination against half elves may soften some too. I would, wouldn't be so sure about that just because the Pope has fallen doesn't mean people's minds will change that easily. That's why you got me to help, the great zealous friend of the half elves. The kingdom still has some rough days ahead of it. I'm curious if. The bathhouse here is open yet. I know it'll open after this event. For sure it'll be open after. Kitty. Alright. Time to go to Flanor. The cooking. Still trying to do the tenderloin. This is the make or break point in the game for uh, do we carry on into the end of the game. Oh. Ah, where's Zealous? What's wrong with him? Why is he always wandering off at a time like this? But I have a choice. Let's go see the doctor first. The good doctor. Why do we have to come way out here just to find a doctor? If you want just any doctor regardless of skill, there's plenty, but there's several wild that are few who could save it. We would... Won't get anywhere by staying around talking. We need to hurry up. Yeah, I know. Hang in there, Altessa. How about getting tongue tied? Can't believe what you're wearing. It's an endurance contest or something? Alright. We're gonna go to the doctor here in just a second. I remember you. Oh, it's because I'm dressed as Sheena. Mind over matter. Brr, cold, cold, cold. Such a wimp, Floyd. Doesn't matter if I'm a wimp or not, it's still cold. Just don't think about it. At least on the subject, how could you not be we cold wearing short sleeves and shorts? Right now you're starting to mention it, it's starting to feel really cold. I see what you mean by thinking about it. Alright, yeah, we need to get some vegetables because we're gearing up. Anius is a weird rock they made me ingest. Use that to make a ring of the pact, huh? Can I really do this? Oh, so there you are. Why are you mumbling to yourself? But well, Lloyd, you're late. Hospital's right here. Come on, hurry up. Oh. 
Doctor? Oh my, if it isn't Sheena. It's been a while. How's everyone at Mizuho? It's an emergency. We have someone who's about to die. Oh my, it sounds like things aren't quiet and peaceful. Stop standing there and chatting. Hurry up and get ready to go. It'll cost you. How can you talk about money at a time like this? I'm not running my business as a charity. You. We'll pay anything, so please hurry. Take advantage of people when they're in need. Fine. We'll give you as much as you like. How much do you want? Let's make it payment upon success. First, I need to see the patient. Travel expenses, hazard pay will be billed separately. Fine, whatever. Please give me an estimate. Let's see. The three of you will be good. We'll borrow your re-arg, Lloyd. Okay, I guess I'll wait here in the city. Who is it? Come on in. Lloyd, did I wake you? It's snowing outside. I was wondering why it was so cold. Yeah, it's really cold. You sure sound happy. Yeah, I mean, I can actually tell it's cold. I'm so happy! That's right. You couldn't feel things like that just a little while ago, huh? Say, Lloyd, if you don't mind the cold, do you want to go for a little walk? Uh... See, this is where we run into the thing. We're gonna have three visitors, and, uh, they're gonna come visit us. If we leave with them, they give us their special item. The problem is... If you have multiple playthroughs you have to do because you're the goal is you want to get all the people to come visit you. And if you reject them all, Kratos comes and visits you. So do we really want to go for a walk? Uh I don't know. Should we say sure or I'm sorry? Trying to think, because I'm going to say I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, no, it's okay. I'm sorry for bothering you. I'm getting all happy and excited at a time like this when Altessa is suffering. I'll go back to my room. Who is it? Hey. Do you have a sec? Sheena! What's up? You want to come outside with me? It's snowing and it's really pretty. See again? Do we want to go out there with her? Eh. He could have his little romantic moment with Sheena, but... Do we want to? I don't know. I'm kind of curious who the third person would be. I'm going to say I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, sorry I bothered you. Who is it? Come on in. Pardon me. I do not think Regal would be the third. That means we have the highest affinity, I believe, with Regal. Regal? What are you doing up at this hour? I apologize for coming late. Would you mind if we stepped outside for a moment? I'd like to have a word with you. It didn't Snow. give me an option. This place is clearly affected by Celsius's presence. It's pretty to look at, but I bet the people that live here have a rough time. Indeed. The only way to survive in this area is through tourism. Hey, your company's main business is tourism, right? Do you own any buildings in Flanor? There should be several ski resorts and hotels of ours in this area. Whoa, you really are rich. I'm not the one that built the company. It was someone in my family many generations ago. Wow, your family's been around for a long time. The X-Sphere mine produced a great deal of wealth for the family. They most likely sold the X-Spheres through a broker, who passed them on to the designs. The fortunes I possess 
were paid for by the blood of the people of Silveront. Yeah, I suppose so. I'm sorry. It's not your fault. Ignorance is no excuse. If anything, it itself is a crime. Well, maybe so, but... That may be part of the reason why Mythos oppresses all life on the planet. What do you mean? Humans are ignorant of their sins, while elves turn a blind eye to them. That frustrates Mythos. Even if that's true, what he's doing is dragging the whole world into a quest for revenge. That's not something that can be forgiven. If so, I too cannot be forgiven. What? Why? For I am on a quest for vengeance against the Crucius. That's different. No, it's not. If the ones who turned Alicia into a monster had been human, I might have followed the same path as Mythos. Your conscience will usually kick in before you get to that point. At least, that's what the professor said. Yes, I'd imagine so. But even still, what I... No, what we are doing is no different than Mythos. No different than Mythos? We are eliminating those who do not share our ideals and those who stand in our way by force. Well, yeah, if you're gonna put it that way. Mythos knows that. That explains why he said the things about the X-Spheres as he was leaving, about the hypocrisy of our protest against sacrificing lives while using these stones that have consumed people's lives. He's really starting to get to me. Are you sure that's not because what he said is true? Maybe. But just because the logic is sound, that doesn't make it right. Hmm. I can't stand what he's doing. That's all there is to it. Yes. Perhaps that is all that needs to be said. By putting myself in Mythos's place, I may have been subconsciously trying to legitimize my own justice. You always think about the complicated stuff. No one wants to be the bad guy. And no one wants to have to put up with things they don't like. Everyone thinks the same way. Is that what you're saying? If you stop and think about the fact that others are the same as you, then you won't do the kinds of things Mythos does. So... You're going to fight him. Tomorrow, after we check on Altessa's condition, I'm going to put an end to all of this. Very well. This chain of tragedy must be broken as soon as possible. Yeah. I'm counting on your support. You have it. Guys, how's Altessa? It seems he is out of danger. Right now, some people from Mizuho and the doctor are watching over him. Good. I need to speak with everyone. The world is never gonna change if we just wait for Crucius to make the next move, right? So this time, we're going to strike them first. Well, so you're finally ready to do it. We're gonna raid Crucius. Yeah, I have two objectives. Prevent the establishment of Mythos's New Age and release Origin. But if you release Origin, what about Kratos? I don't really know yet. We don't know for certain that he'll actually die. We also don't know if he'll side with us or not. We don't have the time to worry about things we're not sure of. What do you intend to do about the Eternal Sword? Even if you break Origin's seal, you can't wield it, remember? And I doubt either Genus or I would be able to handle a sword. Don't worry about that. I've got it covered. What are you talking about? Why do you think I can use magic swords? I received magic injections with the latest in Tetheala technology. In other words, I'm a human with elven blood in me. That should work, shouldn't it? Then I guess this will be the final battle. Understood. Let us end this. For the sake of uniting the worlds. Yeah. I'll do my best, too. Colette, I need you to stay behind. Why? They want you as Martel's vessel. We'll have either Mizuho or the Renegades hide you. If... that's what you want. No, I'm going too. But... <laughs> I get it. You don't think you can protect her. That is so sad. What did you say? Don't worry, Colette. I, the great Zelos, swear to protect you. Zelos! 
take her along, Lloyd. They're gonna be after her no matter where she is. You ought to know that by now. Be a man, show her what you're made of. Wow, we actually have the same opinion for once. Sorry, Lloyd, but I agree with Zealous this time. All right, Colette will come with us, okay? Thank you, Lloyd, and everyone else, too. Does Ted Thayala really have a technology like that? It sure does, for some weird reason. All right, let's go kick some Crucius butt, Lloyd. Zelos, I trust you. What? What are you talking about? Well, of course I can understand that you're counting on me. Just place your faith in me. Faith, huh? I hope so. Yeah, yeah, come on, let's go! Yeah, let's go. Do you really trust all Zelos here? Yeah, come on, Mama, hurry. Ah, all right, dear, no need to rush. What you looking at, Zelos? Ah, uh, quite impressive. Yes, this is sculpture. It's quite impressive, really. Uh huh. Hey, uh, Lloyd. Ah, oh, forget it. Never mind. What? Tell me. It's serious enough, and don't worry about it. Yeah, well, if you're sure. Maybe someday, though. Do you say something? No questions. Let's get moving. My toes are going numb. Mine, too. Bigfoot. Oh, such energetic. He's such a handful. Oh, some of uh, charms of human heart. Worrying brother. <laughs> I'm really surprised to see Celis in the Colosseum. Yeah, I'm glad Zelos and Celis have come to an understanding. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. What's wrong, Zelos? You don't sound well. Oh, it's nothing, my dear Colette. Oh, really? I was certain you were worried that Salus might be following us. Oh, so that's it. Yeah, we're worried about Salus as well. No, no, it's nothing like that. I am the cool and sexy Zelos. Doesn't waste time worrying about his sister. Oh, so you don't care about Salus at all? Not really. She's only my half-sister. A speaking devil, there's Celis. What? That idiot. How many times have I told you it's too dangerous, you can't come with us? Where is she? Just kidding. Ah ha 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 ha. Celis, you're so nice. Miss Rain, don't think I'll forget this. Alright, well. Now, instead of a journey of world regeneration, we're on the journey of side quests. There's a crap ton of them. They all just opened up. Alright. There's a lot to do here. Um, we need to go back to Mizuho. Trying to think of everything. We need to visit Altessa. Can I do anything about these rocks? I can't believe that Mythos is Lord Eudrasio. Cough, cough.
Panera's robotic maid is. Drazette for a second. Nothing else here. Yet, I should say. Correction. Mizuho. Talk to all the women. Hello, madam. Hi, beautiful. Child. They respond with respect and honor to Kunicho even that in this current state. Honey, how are you? The weather is so nice today. Ah, oh, you're charming. How oh, I chose one. Success. It looks like you got all those treasure chests from the areas you've been to. I want to say, I think we got all the monsters here, too. Uh, can you try gone? It must be painful for Orochi. Strange smells are coming from the chief's house. I think it's the chief's voice. Is the chief awake? No, I haven't heard anything. Grandpa. If the chief... If the chief were in good health, I'm sure he'd be happier anyone about Shino's progress. I see a rumor like that. It's true the chief's voice is heard periodically. Volt, volt. Grandpa. One, two, three. What is he saying? Sounds like he's counting some, but there are some missing. Grandpa, what's missing? It's no use, he always ends there. What if it has something to do with Volt? Grandpa was with me in the Temple Lightning when I fell the pack of Volt. He's been asleep since. Now how about we visit the Temple Lightning once more? Yeah, Sheena, let's go have a look. Maybe there's some clues. Yeah, I hope so. Twelve years since the chief fell in the coma. Twelve years? And you're acting as the Interim chief for 12 years? Why didn't you just take the title? Somewhere over here. One, two, three. Grandpa's voice. Okay, let's go. Might as well take out a few enemies along Don't the way. Don't worry, leave it to me. Uh, fire seal. Uh, fire seal. Ice tornado. Uh, fire. All talk, no action. We are going to uh, change up our party. I like to put Zealous. Wait, I gotta make sure we got everything. We did come back here and we never. never blast. Oh, wait, no, they're all back. Oh, this temple was a pain, too. Um, I remember where everything even was. Not much of a specimen. Fire seal. Come uh, uh, get some. Uh, Air thrust. Uh, uh, Fire seal. Uh, Fire seal. Uh, Not even a contest. Enderline.
Oh, we ran out of tomatoes. The shortcake is next. Wait, just making sure. Yeah, she finished it. Gina is our primary. Grandpa? Five, six, there are three missing. Grandpa, three missing. What? What's missing? With just these, I cannot defeat Vault. Grandpa, it's me, Sheena. I made a pack with Vault. Grandpa. Sheena, summon Vault. If you do that, maybe he'll notice. Okay, I'll try. Call upon the Hammer of Godly Lightning. I summon the Come Vault. Oh, what's going on? Huh, who are you people? Grandpa. Thanks, Vault. You can go back now. What? Did you make a pack of Vault? Sheena's gonna be sad. Grandpa, it's me. I'm Sheena. What are you talking about? Sheena's only seven. Grandpa, it's been more than ten years since Vault accident. I'm Sheena. Sheena Fuji Bayashi, the child you found in Gurarachi Forest. Are you really? But if that's so, then what have I... Maybe your astral body, your heart separated from your body during the Vault accident. Is that possible? He's using an X here, it's quite possible. Seems that they make it easier for the body, or for the heart and the body to separate. If that's true, then some of the villagers use X spheres. Then what does that mean? I'm just a consciousness? How do we save Grandpa? What if we return him to his body? How? It's likely that it's just his consciousness that is lost. Let's take him back to the village. Aha, don't treat me like a baby. I've already come to understand this body. Let's see. Oh, this is pretty convenient. Seems a waste to return to my original body. Grandpa, this isn't time to play around. Aha, don't get angry. Well then, I shall go ahead, Sheena. I'll be waiting for you at the village. Grandpa. If he's in such good spirits, I'm sure there will be no need to worry. Let's return to Mizuho. Sheena, Chief has awoken. Uh, yeah. Come on, hurry. Wait. Chief awaits. Grandpa! Sheena. Yes, Chief. Congratulations. What? You succeeded in making the pack with Vault. I'm very proud of you. Grandpa. Let's leave them alone for a little while. I've heard it seems we owe you a debt of gratitude for taking care of Sheena. I don't know. Chica's plans will not change even though I am awake. But yeah, the people of Mizuho will be co cooperate with you in building the world you see. Yeah, we'll work hard too. In regards to that, we would like to have Sheena remain in the village for a short while. What for? I can't say now. It is the Chief's orders. It is nothing to worry about. Let's see. Just leave her with us for one night. Sorry guys, I promise I'll be back. Just wait a little. Alright, we'll go kill some time elsewhere and come back for you. What are they doing? I'll find out tomorrow, right? Yeah. I wonder if Alicia, too, is an astral body. I wanted to save her. If Alicia had a body, would she have been able to live? No, that opposed the laws of nature. I'm sorry. Astral body, I wonder what I'd do if I became like that. Well, let's go to bed. Did not realize that that was going to be a cutscene. Crap. Sheena has completed the ritual just moments ago. Sheena and I restored all 12 of the Lost Guardians. Thus, Sheena shall become the next chief. Are there any objections? If Sheena's power will open a new world to us, then even those of us who bear the scars from Volt We'll have to, no choice but to recognize Sheena. Yes, but for now, congratulations, Sheena. Congratulations, next chief. Sheena obtained the title successor. Thank you, everyone. Sheena, in order to be truly recognized as chief, you must reunite the world. Do your best for Kochinawa's sake as well. Yeah, I'll do my best to become a chief who will make Kochinawa want to come back. Lloyd, as you see, Sheena has been chosen to become the next chief. 
That's what it was for all the preparations that Sheena stayed in the village. Sheena is currently working to bring new hope to the people of Mizuho. The new world brought about by reuniting the worlds, right? Yeah, so we lead the village into new prosperity by renaming her the next chief. Work hard to reunite the worlds and allow the people of Mizuho and all life to find hope. Alright, let's do our best, Sheena. Yeah. Now, uh, then everyone, I leave my granddaughter Sheena in your care. Alright. Take a quick second, and we'll be right back. Alright. Had a allergy attack there for a minute, but we should be good now. Got everything we need there. They're good. They're good. We're gonna talk to the chief here in a second. Your person's not back yet. Next chief. You look cool, Sheena. You really look like a chief. Aha, oh stop it, you're embarrassing me. Oh, working on your accepting speech as the next chief. I got an idea, I'll start working on let's see, on this pleasant day. But if it's raining on that day, you can't use that. How about on this fine day or something? On this fine day, I accept the position of chief. Next, she should probably talk about her management objectives. Management, huh? Because being a village leader is kind of like being a manager. I hate the sin, not the center. Or number one, hate the sin, not the center. Our customer smiles are our, our company's treasure. This old man, he played three. He played... Stop making... Taking over my speech. Nice. Oh, what is it? What well, was it you were counting in the Temple Lightning? Oh, that? Those were the 12 guardians that protect the village. The time of Volt, the Volt accident, Grandpa gave me three of the guardians. The guardians you used when you were going after Clet were... Yes, every chief uses them to protect the village. I completely forgot about doing that. I didn't even realize I had become a spiritual being. And then looking for the guardians in the order to defeat Volt and Sheena's place. Wow, you really love Sheena. Hehehe. <laughs> Astral body thing was pretty convenient. I wish there was a technique like that amongst the stealth techniques. I'm glad Chief Ira has woke up now. Sheena will be able to concentrate on the battle to reunite the world. Would you like to rest? Oh, yeah. Though your duty is successor, Sheena, I'll always do your best. Dude, my allergies are still kicking up. The chief awakens. Can't believe the chief was with Vault the whole time. But now the people of Mizuho can finally relax. So happy for you, Sheena, the chief finally woke up. Thanks, yeah, I'm really happy. Like it might be able to like Volt. You know what's wonderful? That's wonderful. Overcoming the painful events of your past like that. I want to learn to be like you. Ah, stop it! It's just simple-minded, you know. Yeah, exactly. Sheena's got the brains of an amoeba. You better shut up before I smack you. You don't say that after, don't you say that after you smack me. Alright. So now, go to Cybeck. I can remember where Cybeck is. Over here. Don't know if there's anything here. I know we pretty much opened up stuff across the entire, both worlds. We're gonna talk to everyone real quick. Ooh. 
We got all the monsters. We got all the items. You're good. What about you? I think really need to have customizations. Nothing really there. She gave us her lemon. Somebody offers you their lemon, you take it. Welcome. Yeah. Please take care. The beloved. Mythos Cup. The two worlds are our oyster. Now we must go and plunder that oyster. And talk to everyone. Because there are now new quests opened everywhere. It's gonna be a lot of us talking to people we've talked to before. But they may have different things for us now. And we also want to make sure we talk to every woman as Zelos. And hopefully we have not missed one. We'll start upstairs and we'll do these back rooms. I know for sure we gotta go to Mel Tokyo. We have a dinner party to attend. We also gotta go to the hot springs and pervert zealous can peek at some people. Stairs down. I'm really hoping I talk to everyone in Palma Costa. I'm just now thinking that as Zelos. If I didn't, we really screwed up. I'm really hoping we did. This is also one of the main reasons I wanted to come here. We are in desperate need of food items. Alright. Yeah, we have one tomato. Tomato is one of the most versatile fruit, man. You make so many good things with a good tomato. Actually, I can't remember if I talked to this dude. I talked to you. Yeah, I did.
again, sorry that it, it's kind of slow to watch us talk to every person in a city. But it's also will trigger us to do side quests. Talk to you. I don't think we ever see Kate again in this game. But we should be officially done with Cybeck. I don't think we should ever have to come back here now. I want to go to Xir. Yeah, we'll do a quick trip in Xir. Xir, however you say it. Beautiful one. Oh, I think it'd be really cool to be on a floating city. You get to see the world from literally your doorstep. Kind of has a skyward sword feel. Hello, madam. Hi, honey. Says, looks like the wow. That's a lot of miss monsters. <laughs> I was not expecting it to be that high. I wonder if their view though is the whole world. Oh my beloved! Oh, you found me. I can't carry more lemon. Hello, princess. How are you? Hello, princess. Well, oh, she gave me her tuna. Virginia. You know my mother. I see, so you're Virginia's. If you know my mother, please tell me. Is she, is she in the city, isn't she? You should not meet her, even if you did. It you should not meet her, even if you did, it would do you no good. Lloyd, please find Virginia. Right, okay. Half elf health human travelers, that's a rare combination. So we're looking for somebody named Virginia. The We can find somebody. Meets that description. Cause there's one, that's really rare. Last place of repose, repose for us half elves. Do I have to be Lloyd or do I have to be Rain. I don't know. All right, we're looking for someone named Virginia. imagine what state she's in. I 
Yeah, it's a pun there. That was freaky. Totally not demonic at all. You wouldn't have to be Virginia, would you? You know Virginia. Do you know Virginia? Virginia? Virginia. You'd best avoid that place. Why? There's an elf woman who lives there, and she's a bit of a strange one. It can't be. Mother is in this house? Found her. Who's there? Excuse us. I have something I would like to ask you. Oh, half-elves. My child is a half-elf, too. It's a doll. See? She has such an intelligent-looking face, doesn't she? Her name is Rain. She's my pride and joy. Huh? She has the same name as... It can't be. Right now, I have another child on the way. I've already decided on a name. If it's a girl, it's Jean. If it's a boy, it's Genus. What do you think? Aren't they lovely names? What? Then... Are you Virginia? Yes, that's right. How did you know? <gasps> Stop this! Professor Sage! Stop this! What were you thinking? Do you know what happened to the two of us since you abandoned us? Wh what? Why are you raising your voice like that? You'll wake Rain! I'm Rain! I'm the daughter you shunned and abandoned, not that doll! Genus is here too! What are you talking about? There must be something wrong with you! You're the one that's wrong! How could you... How could you... Oh, 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 now you've gone and made Rain cry! Please leave! There, there, hmm? It's okay, Rain. The scary people have gone now. Don't cry. <laughs> Rain! How could she? First she abandons her children, and then she abandons the memory of doing so. She doesn't even remember us. Rain, don't cry. So, you met Virginia. Why is she here? Several years ago, I found a husband and wife collapsed of exhaustion in the Umir forest. It was Virginia and her husband, Kloitz. Father. It seems Kloitz was dispatched from Mel Tokyo to investigate the elf village. He fell in love with Virginia and remained in Heimdall, but... But a half-elf that lived in the village tried to sell out our father to the soldiers. It became a huge incident. Fighting broke out between the elves and half-elves. The cause of the incident, Virginia's family, was banished from the village. They traveled from land to land, but the world was not kind to half-elves. And we were abandoned. So it would seem. And Kloitz must have been ill, for he died soon after they arrived in this village. Virginia began to lose her mind from that day. She's unbelievably selfish. She tosses us aside on a whim, and then forgets us, and just goes off into her own little world of dreams. Even so, Virginia was worried about you two. In the legendary land of Silverant, surely half-elves will be free from discrimination. I want them to be happy. That's what she said. I've heard enough! I've been keeping Virginia's diary safe here. You can come get it at any time, if you ever decide you want it. Dang. Please leave us alone. The cool thing about being an elf, half-elf, you live a long time. Bad thing is, sometimes your mind doesn't stay with you. Like, that's sad. 
You're nothing without your mind. There's no point in being a, alive if you can't actually understand it. Understand it at all. What makes Alzheimer's and all that so sad? They take care of yourselves the best of your abilities. Do you want to read the diary? Yes. Professor, this is... Uh. The otherworldly gate has opened. Rain, Genus, please forgive your powerless mother. Surely even the Imperial Research Academy will not follow you to Silverant. This must be a better choice than to spend your life in that damp, filthy dungeon like a slave. Please, make your way to freedom. What did she mean? Rain, you must have been incredibly talented. It seems the Imperial Research Academy was dying to get its hands on you. That's why we couldn't settle down anywhere and had to keep traveling. Eventually, you were chased all the way to the otherworldly gate. It seems she managed to send you through it. Mother... Then... She didn't abandon us because we were in the way, or that she hated us or anything! Yes, that's right. Rain! This is great news! This diary... Take it with you. It is your mother's, after all. Thank you. That's sad. There's not that many people in this village either, so they would all know what's going on with her mother. I'm curious if she has anything else to say now. Okay, them glitching out like that freaks me out. How about some otherworldly crap? Anything else? Finally fell asleep. Doesn't she look adorable? Alright, now to hit on her at Zelos. Don't go near that place. I already did. Mother. Sorry, Genus. You mean about Mother? You didn't do anything wrong. But, she kept silent about it because she believed that would be the best thing for me, right? Or you kept I can understand that much. Thank you, Genus. Where are we? Okay, we're way over here. Talk to you. Claire, we have been waiting for you. The remodeling work on the hot spring is complete. By all means, please enjoy the waters of the church's prized bath. Wow, a hot spring. It's like a big bathtub, right? Let's go in. Hee <laughs> hee, the water here is marvelous. Come on, let's go in. I'll show you around. Ta da, this is the pride and joy of the church of Martel, the Corlean hot spring. Hey, didn't this place used to have separate baths for males and females before the renovation? I thought you mentioned that there is only one bath. You gotta be kidding me. I'm not going in there with you guys. Huh, you're no fun. Whatever, let's just go in. 
Oh, this feels great. Too bad she and the others cannot enter as well. Oh yeah, the girls should just come in here by themselves after we're done. Good idea, then we can come in without worrying. He <laughs> yeah. Alright. Welcome. You were using the hot spring, yes. To the females. Alright, please go on in. Hey, I'll wash your back, Sheena. Sounds good, I'll do yours too. I feel like I could just forget about the fight that we're currently involved in. It's important to relax sometimes. Also, having fond memories like this will get us more attached to being alive. Yes, I'd like to stay alive. I wish everyone could be happy. Yeah, let's hope that will happen. Yes. Hey, where are you going? Where else? To the bath. But the girls are in there now. That's why I'm going to peek. Who can resist? Ah, oh, Professor Sheena, you both have such nice figures. Oh, I'm very ordinary compared to Sheena. Stop it. I swear, it's not all that great, I swear. So it's important to have a nice figure. I'm like an ironing board. Huh, I see. I earned the title, ironing board. Gina earned the title, wow. Let's see, which honey can I see from here? Oh no, stop it. Who's there? Uh-oh. Oh, Sheena, how can you come out looking like that? Lloyd, I can't believe you. I understand if it was that stupid chosen, but I'll never thought you'd stoop so low. Lloyd, it's not true, right? You have a reason, right? No, I didn't come here to peep. Zealous, just... Lloyd, you're disgusting. So disappointed in you. You peeping Tom. <laughs> we got peeping Tom. A misunderstanding. That's hilarious. I'll do Mel's again, see if I... I'd say this isn't a very sexy view. Really? And now that you mention it, Zealous, I bet your brain is pink. No, perhaps purple. Don't take it seriously. Is there another cutscene? Sad. If you're sad, I'll cry with you. If you're happy, I want to smile. If you're lost, I'll be lost with you. The most important words I can say is I love you. Alright. Did you hear they aren't separate springs for males and females? Hi, honey, are you? Young miss, beautiful one, hello. 500 gold. So are we gonna go see mother? Yes, we will someday. It feels kind of strange. I mean, you're my sister. At the same time, you're like a mother to me. Sorry, are you angry? No, that's not it. Go on to bed. Tomorrow will be another early day. All right. Good night, Rain. Good night. Please take care. No, I don't want to rest again. Oh, we saw the bathing scene. The Eternal Obsession. The Rain was obsessed with the ruins because she was searching for her mother. She may have acted that way in order to hide her true feelings. I feel sorry for her. But her now and Rain will be... Ah. 
That was how dare you break that valuable Barclay Dynasty vase. I won't forgive you this time. Please, Professor Rain. I'll be happy to buy you as many vases as you. Ah, uh, huh. Exactly the same. Though it seems. Die. Alright. To melt Tokyo! Yeah. There should be quite a bit to do here. We're gonna go visit everyone we can. Should be a dinner party. See him. Fuck this dude. Talk to you. Come on, kitty. You've already got all the monsters unique in this region. We're gonna have to start writing down where we've uh, for sure cleared. Hello, Beauty, Princess, or Rosebud. Little Snot. I remember the boy was kind of rude. False accusations. How are you, Madam? Chosen one. Every time, Kong Pound after the fist. The freaking. Oh, Chosen one. Wee 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 wee. Adam. Man. Backpacker. Maid. Every city's an adventure. Miss you, honey. Oh, chosen one. Madam, please, chosen one. You can make quite a good chunk of money just going around talking to everyone as Zelos. Thank you so much for intervening that time. So Joshua, Joshua, and Rosa, why are you here? We were banished. I went to the Viscount Cronwall in order to take her back and then end up confronting him. Joshua was expelled from the academy and he lost the use of his right hand. That's awful. Sounds something like a man would do. Now that we're completely penniless, haha. What are you laughing about? That's alright, I'll just start over again. I have Rosa with me now. With her, I think I can start over. Here. Retain, return the pink pearl ring. This is the ring I gave you. Your sweetheart returned. I think it's the ring like that to return to its original owner as well. Thank you. Please take good care of both the ring and him. Hang in there. If you have any trouble in the city, you can rely on the Chosen for help. Hey, don't just go use my name like that. Then he is Zealous the Chosen. Ah, oh, well, I think would be better off asking Duke Bryant for help. We have the... When we have the chance, we will ask His Majesty about possibly remediating you to the Academy. Oh no, I don't deserve such kindness. If a real wants to do that, just go ahead and accept it. After all, even if you are re-admitted... What happens after that will be up to you. Happy for you too. Thank you. I'll never forget you. You're best now. We will. We will. So we reunited them and it feels so good. 
Are you mad? Oh, thank you. They say that you should not fear trouble. You work hard when you're young. Flower seller. Drunk gambling man. Backpacker with a dog. Got a boy with a secret base. And a mom hanging clothes. Oh my goodness, go down the stairs. Alright, so we know we have to go talk to his majesty. The Clang. Clang a Tepiala. Beautiful rosebud, chosen one. Seems uneasy, a little princess. A little beauty. Everyone trying to give me their energy tablets. Man, I use some energy tablets today. I I do feel a little low energy. I was kind of sick yesterday. Still feel like I'm recuperating. It was uh, no bueno. I had a migraine slash sinus headache from hell. Like nothing was getting rid of it. I'll see him. Taking Cedrin tension, Cedrin migraine, Cedrin PM, sinus medication. doing another call Coliseum run right now unless we're Kratos if we're Kratos we do it because we haven't done it as him honey beauty charming Beauty, honey. Other honey. It throws me off. It looks like it goes towards the dungeon and then bam, castle. I think anything if I'm regal because he was in these prisons. Gotta, you always gotta try. I talked to you, right? Yeah, I did. Like I said, we're just double checking that we talk to everyone we can. Hopefully, we 100% Fallon Lacosta. Crossing fingers. Because if not, we screwed up, and that's a whole nother play there of Zelos. We chose Zelos over Kratos. It's kind of sad because I like Kratos better. Royal Chambers? Oh, I'll enter.
I don't know what to do. What's wrong? Her mother collapsed due to illness. I want to go see her right now, but we're short on people today. Terrible, I'll help. What, Will? Oh, whoa, whoa. What are you so surprised about? Well, it works in a place like this, she will be able to visit her mother. It's true. Work as hard as I can in your place. I hope the castle doesn't wind up with any holes in it. I'm worried. Please take my place. What should I do? Carry the food from the kitchen. Yes, ma'am. Miss Club, what are you doing? I'm sorry. Carry it again. Yes, ma'am. That's enough. Bring a bucket and clean this place. Yes, ma'am. I'm sorry. Ah, oh, what are you doing? I'm sorry. Today's work is finally over. You were totally useless. Why does quarter is such polish much more than it was this morning? Yes, your highness. Because of the excellent training that everyone works as hard as they do. You have my compliments. Thank you, your highness. Um, Miss Clip, thank you for your help today. You worked very hard. I'll reward you. I'll give you 100 gold and that uniform. Oh, thank you. For 100 gold, and play got the title of maid. Miss Clip, thank you so much. Was your mother all right? Ah, oh, yes, thank you. Miss Grace seemed to be in a rather good mood. Yes, she was happy being complimented by the princess. Ah, because if the princess compliments her, her pay goes up. Also, your companions are waiting for you at the entrance of the castle. Okay, thank you. Did you mess up? Did you make any holes in the castle? Uh, Miss Grace complimented me, her pay went up, and I got new clothes and earned money. See, yeah, that's great. I don't understand you at all. Audience chamber, crowd. Once it may serve, may enter, may not approach the throne. Welcome, please relax, stay as long as you like. I'm in your debt, yeah, my thanks. While we're here, you gotta, dude, you gotta help. What I have to do is Lloyd. Regal. Alright, maybe we just have to come back another time. You're my beloved. Good girl, hee hee. Zealous would be cancelled in today's culture. Beloved, chosen one. Before we go over there. Nothing back there. Do one last look over here and then we'll leave this section. Funky. There's a dinner party in there we gotta do. Phyllis, you never come by anymore. I've been so worried about you. Hey. This is a girl who was dressed as an angel. Why is she with Zealous? Oh, yes, I'm sorry. Oh, and Sheena's with him too. I thought I was told the people from Izuho is not to approach Zealous. Well, I'm not with him because I want to be. He's always jabbering away obnoxiously. Ah. Ha ha. My, oh my, as vulgar as ever. You talk like a middle-aged woman. What? 
My cute honeys, if y'all get to love me, then you get to under all long understand. But Zellos. Okay, okay, then I'll drop by all your houses later, so let's split up for now, okay? You understand, right? I only have one body, I can't express my love for all of you at the same time. Zellos, make sure you keep your promise. I'll be waiting for you. I'd heard rumors of Chosen's debauchery, but... Um, Duke Bryant, when was the last time we met? I was six years old. How did you hear anything like that about me? Your reputation <laughs> precedes you. I didn't have to meet you to hear about your escapades. Even after I went to prison, the guards said that you're quite the man about town. Oh. He can do whatever he wants with whomever he wants, as far as I'm concerned. I'm tired of putting up with this every time we go to Melotokyo. Do something. It can't be helped. The little birds flock to my beauty. Then let's cover your face. What? Ah, for now, you don't get any of those noisy grumpies following us around anymore. Ah, not too bad. No one can see your beauty that you're so proud of. Oh no, my beauty shines from within and cannot be hidden by a mask. Now you can call me the Mystery Mask Handsome Warrior Zealous. What is that ugly mask? This is why I can't stand country folk. Hi, right, woman's love is so shallow. Zell's tied to obtain the title Mass Swordsman. Apple Knights. Haha, hello, Chosen. Deepest apologies. Madam. Aw, oh, she's gonna give her us her pasta. Great, mysterious, handsome warrior. Did you see that? The great, mysterious, masked, handsome warrior zealous work. Hey, can I ask you a question, Mr. Mysterious, masked, handsome warrior? Certainly, young man. Ask me anything you like. If you're wearing a mask, how can you even tell that you're handsome? Well, it's obvious when you see an unmasked face, right? I'd like to ask you some, too. Oh, great chest of China. Ask me anything. If you're supposed to be mysterious. Why are you still using the name Zealous? Oh, well, that's, uh... May I ask you something as well? What is it, my dear Perseo? Are you hiding your face because the outfit is embarrassing? Ah, oh, that hurt my feelings. Famous musician. Your guest. Um, was it Perseo? Just trying to see if there's anything with triggers. Go, go, go. Be it, be it, so slow. Oh, Lord Zealous, a package from His Majesty has arrived. Oh, yeah, the celebration or whatever it was. Our outfits and invitations for everyone have arrived. Wow, I wonder what kind of outfits they are. I can't wait to try them on. The party will be held this evening at the reception center. Never been to a party before, I'm nervous. Yes, the reception center is only for nobles. Is it alright for us to go? It's fine, don't worry about it now. Let's get ready. So where's my stuff? I'm afraid there was a mistake and Sir Bud did not her buds did not arrive. No, listen, it's Lloyd. What's this none for me? Yes, I'm about to send a messenger to the castle. Huh, I'll go to the castle and get it myself. You all go on ahead without me. Okay, don't get lost now, Bumpkin. Where are you calling a Bumpkin? If I don't hurry up, the party is going to start. What do you want? His Majesty has already left for the reception center. My outfit didn't show up. What's going on? What? Wait just a moment. I'll make an inquiry. Sorry to keep you waiting. They left it in the dressing room. Tell Sissy to change you. Please come inside. What? No, that's okay. I can change myself. That will not do. Come on. The party will start soon. Please hurry. Now we've prepared the nobleman style, which is very popular currently.
Why, it suits you well. Really? Lloyd, obtain the title nobleman. Well then, we'll escort you to the party hall. I can go by myself. Now, now, don't say that. Here, we go, everyone. Ah. That was bad. Anyways, this is luxurious. Mr. Lloyd, I presume your companion is waiting for you at the rear Terrence. I'm gonna take a moment here. He's about to sneeze. Alright. So do we think it's Colette, Genus, the Professor, Sheena, Zellos, Persea, or Regal? I'm gonna say Colette. That's Colette. My other guests are anxiously awaiting your arrival, Mr. Lloyd. How about speaking to them before heading to the Terrence? I suppose I could talk to three of them or so. And then night will it turn out to be. Whoa. Alright. We got a few different people here. We got Genus, looks like. Hey, Lloyd. Sheena looked at my outfit and made fun of me. Then I um, look like I'm dressed for Easter Sunday. What's Easter Sunday? Seems like the children ritual me the hell. Easter Sunday. I wish I could turn the camera because I can't quite see who I'm looking at. Regal? Oh, your face is red. Well, the Chosen have been calling me Dandy, so everyone is now looking at me suspiciously. Ah, oh, but you don't really have dandy feelings of dandiness about you. Do I? Dandy. So I don't see Colette. Oh, that's Sheena over there. You got Prisea. Oh, well, what do you think of me all dressed up? Yeah, you look cool. Don't I? I'm the most stylish guy in the kingdom. No matter what you're wearing, you're still narcissist. I think I should head over to the Terrans. Oh, Lloyd, thank goodness you're late, so I was worried. It took a little time getting ready. I've never worn something like this before. Hey, but you look so cool. Hey, your outfit looks good on you too, Colette. Thanks. I'm happy you say that. Man, Tate Thayala is amazing. There wasn't anyone dressed up like this in Silveron. Yeah, it is an amazing place. Everyone is rich. Yeah. Don't laugh now, okay? What? Isn't it kind of stuffy? I thought so too. Want to sneak out? If you want to, I'll go too. Okay, let's go. Fair lady. Yeah, that party yesterday was more than I expected. Well, that's not something poor folk usually do. I told you not to call us poor. Please? Alright, yeah. Let's see. Anything? Rose of Battle gives us more. We're gonna switch to your outfit here. Supergirl. Or friendship first. Is that more than Supergirl? Supergirl's better. Gladiator Queen. It's been a while since we've changed our titles. Ultimate Kid is still the best. Deadly Flower. Empty Soul. Actually really sad to say. Alright. 
We're king of the Colosseum. Okay, so you do have God of the Kitchen. Grand Champion. Alright. I'm gonna double check, there's nothing going on in any of the rooms. That was fun, I like having the big party. It's sad that they have such a big mansion for this great party, but they don't invite everyone to it. Yeah, I know it's the castle. I'm trying to go speak to the king, his majesty. When you're dead. Alright. Still can't talk to you about, uh... Oh, what's his face? May need to leave and come back. Let's head out of the city and we'll come right back in. See if the cats reset as well over here. Not who I was trying to talk to. Looks like there are two treasure chests in the area you've not yet gotten. That sucks, because I have no idea where they are. Let's see if we can talk to his majesty now. Here am I dead? No. Any more cutscenes going towards the slums? Yeah. Hey, there was someone chasing the cats just now. What? I wasn't looking. Honestly, Lord, I think you ran that way. Genius, don't go running off on your own. Damn, he got away again. What's wrong? Why are you chasing the cats? Ah, my grandpa wants to see a cat, so I thought I'd get one to see him. Grandpa's sick and can't move. I see. No matter how much I beg those cats, they refuse to come see grandpa. Why does your grandpa want to see cats? I don't know, he says he used to study them a long time ago. I see. Well, if there aren't any cats, I'll uh, take them to your grandfather. Really, grandpa lives in the back of the slums. My name's Vice. I'm Genus. Nice to meet you. Genus, son, thanks for your help. Yes, we've been looking all over for you. Hey, Lord, I have a favor to ask. So we just need to bring a cat's here, then? A cat's a non-human life form that exists throughout the world. If I'm not mistaken, there are some in the city. Let's go talk to them. Alright. Where are you? So back to the cats. This is what I meant. There's a lot of like side quests and missions happening or available. <laughs> hey, please come see an old man in the slums. Do you mean Noah? I don't know his name, but he used to study cats, didn't he? has a grandson named Vice. 
Yeah, that's Noah. I don't want to see Noah. Why not? I just don't, and I'm sure that the others will say the same thing. You can at least tell us a reason. Yeah, ask the elder in our village. Village? Cat's village? Yes, but I won't tell a friend to know where it is. You have to find it yourselves. Fine, we'll find it ourselves, meanie. Alright. We got a few things to go do. We know the cat's village. That's in Silveron. Where's the best way to get over there? way of memorization. Boy, did you do your homework? What was our homework again? Memorizing the preamble to the Paloma Costa Charter? Oh man, yeah, I have trouble with memorizing. You have trouble with all forms of study, you mean? Shut up. The Woods memorize, memorize all the dormant vowels, it's amazing. Really? Really, tell me, how did you learn them? Since I was a child, I memorized one before each meal and was tested on it. And if I couldn't say it, I didn't get to eat. Oh, I see. There must have been a dwarf and vowel memory ingredients in the food. Huh, really? I wonder if I can memorize all the dwarf and vowels if I eat Dirk's cooking. No, Cliff, that's not it. Lloyd's desire for food temporarily strengthened his memory. Oh. The Dirk's food has powers like an exosphere to increase people's abilities. I see. Why does this topic of conversation go out the window when talking to Colette? Colette is very similar to Lloyd. Welcome to Cat's Village. Can't help but love the soundtrack in this village. Talk to everyone while we're here. It says you got all the monsters unique to this region. Dun, 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 dun. Hey, why do the cats not want to see Noah? Yeah, long ago Noah hunted our kind in the name of research. Seems he wanted to study how to make us pets for humans. But that's why cats don't like him. But any will go to Noah. But Noah's sick, they could at least see him. Kid, people who are oppressed half elves were sick. Would you go pay a visit? That's meow, yeah, then I shall give you this. What's this? The suit Noah wore when he hunted us in the past. With this, you can become an imposter cat. Okay, thanks. I wonder if Noah will be fooled by this. I don't know, but let's go talk to Vice about it. Might as well stay a night here in the village.
We're on our world tour of both worlds real quick, so... Actually, it'd probably be faster to go up. Make sure there's nothing over here. Tokyo. Alright. Ultimate kid to... Oh wait, cats, 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 cuz... It puts him in the cat's costume. Yes, how'd it go? Vice. Sorry, the cats hate Noah and they don't want to see him. I see. I got a cat suit, so I'll meet Noah with this. You think this is a bad idea? No, please. Go see him. It's this way. Boy, let's go. Listen, genius. What? We're gonna go lose sight of Vice. No, it's nothing. Honestly, come on, let's hurry. Genius, please talk to him. Right. Noah. Who's there? I'm a cat, it's meow. Oh, I'm sorry, could you come closer? I can't see anymore. This is what? Nothing, thank you. Now I can finally go to Martel. What? My time is drawing to a close, and it seems my guide has come for me. No. Thank you, child. Seeing that cat suit brought back many memories. You knew? I'm a cat's researcher. I can tell that much. Yeah, we forgive you now. Cats, thank you, thank you. You came to me, I tried to capture you. Child, thank you as well. Now I truly have no regrets. Rain, save him. I'm sorry, it's already... It's alright. Vice has come for me. Goodbye. Noah. Thank you, Genus. Vice. Now I can go together with Grandpa. Well, what are you talking about? I've been dead for a long time. You're the only one that's able to see me. I couldn't even get cats to notice me. And you're a ghost. Thank you and goodbye. So he was a ghost. You all couldn't see Vice? That's right. I see. Vice, have fun with your grandfather. Meow. We'll bury Noah. I'm sure he'd appreciate that. Yeah. Wrong one. Alright. The so genus is taken care of. We'll go spend the night again, see if that does anything. And see if we talk to his highness. Old King Heine. I may have to leave again. Because that's how we got the other uh, that scene thing to start. Was leaving and coming back in. Dude, he runs very quickly.
When you're dead. Neither are you. Alright, let's try Bellas. Nope. I hope I don't have to go to Cybeck. I already went to Cybeck. Good chance we have to go here. Since the dude got kicked out, I don't know if it's in here, the library, or if it's over at the other one. It's either here, or we have to wait on something with the king. It'd be very annoying. So it's not the kitchen. Ah, oh, she's going to give us her melons. Dark bottle. I'll be so upset if we can't find where to continue this, because I'll end up forgetting about this submission. served us no real purpose. But we tried. So... Let's see, from here... I don't think there's anything left in Mizaho to do right now. Go check on Altessa. I should have checked on Dirk too. I don't know where his robot is. here. Ah, oh, you're gonna actually make me go all the way through the forest. Wait, leave. There's one over there. We never did. You can't... 
Why can't you swim, Professor? I can swim. Liar, you're afraid of the water. I'm not afraid. Why do you try to act tough? Professor? When I was with my mother and father, we were being chased, so we fled onto a ship. The pursuers caught up to us, and I fell into the ocean. It was winter, and the water was painfully cold. I was swept away by the currents, and I thought I was going to die. Sorry, Professor, I didn't realize you had such a big reason for your fear. Don't worry, if something like that happens again, I'll save you. I'm a pretty good swimmer. Well, thank you, Lloyd. I'm counting on you. Yes, quick jump. We'll be waiting here. Protozoans become extinct a long time ago. I'm not making out. Protozoans really do exist. You believe me, don't you? What's a protozoan? First animal born in the world. Do you know about it? No, I've never really heard about it. Protozoans are primitive life forms that continue to evolve throughout their lives. Evolve! Protozoans are born as single cell life forms. In their first evolution, they could evolve into a creature known as a queen. A queen? A life that looks much like a fish. After that, it evolves into a bird like life form called an Eros. And then into a life form that runs on land called an Arsh. Then next into a Frilla, and finally into a human who hunts evil. Single species changes its form that much. It's a truly a life form that spends its whole life evolving. However, because of their abilities, they use in battle during the ancient war and have become extinct. The last Prozone was seen 4,000 years ago. But I saw it. It was a Prozone. It evolved into an Arsh. Be sure it wasn't something else. Many living things run across the land. An Arshish. What? The legendary Arsh. Wine. I knew it. I saw it in a book. Arshus have big ears and runs fast like the wind. Ow. What are you talking about? No, she is a dog. No, she. Is that this Arsh's name? I'm telling you, he's a dog. He's an Arsh. Arsh that evolved form of a protozoan. Yeah, how can you mistake him for anything else? What? No, she isn't a dog? I've been wondering about that. He... Awfully strange looking for a dog. But he has a tail and he howls. That means he's either a dog or a wolf, right? And he doesn't seem wolfish, so I thought he was a dog. Prozones are a proud ancient species. They're the second oldest after the elves. Really? Why? But Noshi is Noshi, and I don't care if he's a pro or not. Protozoan. Okay. Relationship between elves, not good. What do you got? Nothing good. Alright. Customization. What do you got? Eh, not much. Go hit on the email. Miss you, honey. Oh. Zealous the player. Honey, how are you? Success. Monsters on your list are two. So there's two monsters around that we have not gotten. Is there anything else back here? No. Elder's house is cross bridge to the left. Yeah, I got it.
Are you mad at him? Can't believe it. What were you thinking? Look, outsiders. Come find me, I'm over here. Hello, madam. You must be joking, don't make me angry. Hello, my beloved. What were you doing? It's not a joke. Hey, fine pellets. Oh. Hello, beauty. What are you talking about? You're charming. Please stop that. Kind of gold. Yeah. Not too bad. With elves living so long, I wonder how their inflation is. Please take care. Can't enter here. Excuse me, princess. Summon Spirit Origin. Oh, my beloved. Trying to talk to the child. This you, honey. I like that they all get insulted by Zealous. Can't really blame him. Zealous is kind of a dick. Have more to no more to say to you humans. Let me back here. I can't go in the torrent forest yet. Alright, so from out here, or anything else. Trying to take a quick look. You're gonna regret this! Pyre Seal! Form uh, uh, a torrential Pyre vortex seal. and engulf the Pyre Seal! Spirit. Pyre Seal! That's it? I was just getting started. Alright. So we're in the process of making a shortcake. Not much of a specimen. Oh, holy one. Uh, That's it? I was just getting started. I is what? I because I've changed you out. This is the Abbey, right? A house of guidance. That's your honey. She gave us her chicken. Alright, where am I? Man. 
Don't you guys Fire light up? Seal. <laughs> Fire seal. Ready? Fire seal. Yeah, we're ready. That's it? How's this getting started? We're going to go to Altamira here soon. You're in for a world of hurt. Trying to see if there's anything else we see. That's it? How's this getting started? No, she in danger? No, she has a proud heritage, doesn't he? From his own, first animal born into the world. Born with the power of the giant Carlon tree, united with the land itself. Get ready, Noshi, here it comes. Wine? The wondrous mystery of life. I simply must dissect it. That's it, run. You're in for a world of hurt. Fire seal! Fire seal! Fire seal! Fire seal! Fire seal! That was disappointing. Alright. Nothing else over here. I guess that means it's time to go to Altamira. Okay, there's nothing else over here. Miss Regal, how oh, you've come at the most opportune of times. George, what are you doing here? Why is the mis unmistakable tinge of desperation in your voice? It's the construction, sir. Work on Spa GB has grown to a halt. Spaghetti? Is that some sort of thing you could eat, like spaghetti joint or something? I'm not a big fan of big on tomato sauce, personally. Make sure you have plenty of cream sauce on that menu. Too much of a good thing can numb a man's heart, Lloyd, and probably stop it in that case. Affirmative. Cream sauce contains milk. Milk contains protein, sugars, and fats. Excessive consumption may lead to a lengthy lethargy, drowsiness, and being grossly overweight. He's right. Just look how the cows. They're huge. Wait, why are we humoring Lloyd's idiocy here? It's a spa, isn't it? Huh, <laughs> yes. Yes, it is. Lloyd, a spa resort is a larger complex, a hot spring complex. Imagine some with the scale of Altamira built on top of a natural thermal source. Whoa. So whatever is the cause for the panic, if the project has stalled, speak with whomever is responsible. Not that simple, sir. The issue lies with the church martel. We had settled on a price for the land, but now they refuse to sign. They s suddenly begin raising a fuss about our offers insufficient. They've sent traders to negotiate the matter anew, but they refuse to speak with anyone short of the president. Oh well, go on then. A guy's gotta take care of business, right? I suppose he does, Lloyd. Very well, though. First, I shall be needing more suitable attire. Yes, of course, sir. Duke Bryant. But this isn't... he off on some world tour of philanthropy pageant. He's not supposed to be here. They didn't know, but if he's here, then the plan to draw out a negotiation goes right out the... My apologies for keeping you, gentlemen. You were hoping to see me today, were you not? Of course, Your Grace. Thank you for coming all the way just to sign a simple contract. What? Are you mistaken, sir? We've made it quite clear that we cannot sell such a hollowed site for the penance you've offered. Yes, most amusing. George, the ledger, please. The curious coincidence, gentlemen, that the same day that we heard from you, your accounts each received a deposit of one million gold. Rest assured, in my travels, I am favored with the company of zealous chosen a mana. He said that he will not inquire further into that matter for now. We will return the, with the contract immediately. Good day, sir. Actually done, sir, but why are you certain you wish to let them go? It's fine, but I want a full inquiry 
into their every last move. I'd wager they are up to similar tricks elsewhere. Find hard proof and then serve them up however you'd like. Understood, sir. I realize it's not exactly the position to say this, but the Church of Mortel really is rotten through and through, isn't it? Yeah, seriously, they don't even hide it. That guy's job title is the even traitor. What? No, Lloyd, they were traitors, as they buy and sell things for the church. But they did a pretty bad job of selling this time. Oh, you think the church... You think they went traitor on the church? So they're sneaky, they went double traitor? Little help, Professor. He's beyond my assistance. I can only say that I'm sorry. Regal obtained the title of the Duke. We're gonna step out and come back in. You're new. Mary, Joe, Beth, Diane, where have you all gone? Um, what's wrong? My daughters are lost, what should I do? Lloyd, let's help her find them, look for them. Sure. Sure. Thanks, Lloyd. They haven't left out to Mary, right? Yes, that's for certain. Okay, then, let's find some lost kids. Alright, you're still looking for your daughters. Almost guarantee I know where some of them are. I mean, it's been several years since I've played this game. We'll go to the amusement park first. If I was a little kid running around the city, I'd want to go to the amusement park. This is the amusement park. Well, mom's looking over me. Okay, I'll go back. They got Beth. Just be aware the music park's closed at night. Wow, a bunch of rides. Honey, how are you? Working? Okay. Another happy day. Don Ferris will. They also have a princess play with me. Wrong, are you lost? Sob, sob. I don't know what to do. Lost or you're scaring the kid? One of the two. Let's have a free pass to ride. Little beauty. Well, you found one of the daughters. There were four daughters, we found one. I don't know if there's any of the company, but we'll look. We all love the company. Welcome, welcome. All right, nothing really here. Second floor. Nothing really here. President's office. Why are you telling me to go to the second floor? We've already been there. Did not know you could come up here. It's actually kind of insulting slash wrong that you could walk over the grave. <laughs> Alright. 
So we found one of the children. Beth, she hasn't come back yet. She's a little laid back, so she may not return unless you talk to her several times. Are you serious? We're gonna go to the beach. You're charming, now please. Mary, oh, you're looking for us? I'm sure they aren't all back yet, though. I'll stay here until the others return. Blue water, picturesque. Oh, my beloved. Oh, oh, they're looking for me? Okay, I'll go back. Oh, I'm impressed you realized that I was a girl. So one, one of them will have gone back. Back to the amusement park. I was thinking it's about time to go home. Thank you. Bunch of rides. Alright, so two of them should be back. Maybe one's in the hotel? Have you found my daughters yet? I'm worried about them. talk to them yet because we're not staying in the hotel yet. The person just said marry me. Oh, I'm Diane. I'll return to mom at once. You're cute. Oh, are you lost? Yeah, success. It looks like the number of monsters in the region is three. There's still three more monsters types to get. Right, this should be all the children. Well, there's three. There were only four of them, so that means this girl has it. Oh, everyone's back. Fine, I'll go. Found all my daughters, thank you so much. Oh, don't mention it. Here, have some. Oh, thanks. I said I'm working the manager of the hotel, so please pick it up. Farewell. Oh, looks like. Thanks, let's go have a look. Hi, oh, Master Eagle, and everyone. Please relax and enjoy. Are you Mr. Lloyd? A package has arrived. Ah, oh, must be your thanks. I wonder what it is. I was told that the swimsuits we have prepared change rooms for you. Please come this way. Now yeah, let's everyone let's go have fun. Lloyd obtained the title Beach Boy. Mr. Lloyd, your companion is waiting for you. I wonder who it is. Ah. Uh... I want to say a professor. Lloyd, 
We have to go into the water. What are you talking about? That's boring. Rain attaining the tidal no, not the sun. The ocean is so salty, I'm so excited. Mermaid. I'm looking forward to this since the ocean. I'm looking forward to it. Queen of the beach. Ah, oh, where are the others? But they're getting tired and they're gonna rest in their rooms. Ah, oh, they're no fun. Oh, well, let's go to the beach. Professor, I'll teach you how to swim. That's quite alright. It'll be fine. I heard that the entire area is pretty shallow. Don't be foolish. People can drown even when the water is only knee-deep. But you aren't human, Professor. Don't nitpick. Ow. He's my favorite. Not going in the water. The trip to the beach isn't complete without spilling. There's watermelon splitting. What, are you going to dive? Yeah, it's beautiful underwater, right? I always wanted to go diving once. The ocean in this area is very clear. It is really, really pretty. I know, let's di go dive together. Sheena, can you can dive? Don't sound surprised. I was taught the ninja water techniques by the chief. I'm a good diver. Okay, then let's go. You got it. Oh, I forgot my ninja diving and gadgets. Now that I think about it, this is the first time I've gone ever go swimming with you. Not really, yeah, I guess it's always just been Venus and me. Yeah, I always envied you too. You go play at the far places, but they wouldn't let me out of the village. And I'll teach you the things the two of us did. Yeah. There's jumping, diving, and catching clams and eating them. Oh, and but you're girls, so I guess we shouldn't do anything too rough. I can do it. We used to play sword games in the village, remember? Gotcha. Alright, let's go private Colette's. Yes, sir. They will play until we're all wrinkled. Please we'll go play with Colette's privates. So that's everybody, yeah. That sucks. That means at least one more playthrough, because I have to get Zealous, Regal, and Persea. Actually, I kind of want to reload that. Oh my goodness, what's with the camera angle? It's not supposed to be that way. Oh no. I thought I saved it beforehand, I saved it after. Crap. Alright, well at least we know where all the kids are. that we're redoing this, but I'm trying to pick up and finish so much of Zella's stuff as possible. Maybe next time I do a playthrough of this, I can choose Kratos. Monsters. Uh, so well, at least we already got two kids, so we're doing this a lot quicker. Now we have to go bug Beth until she leaves.
Alright, I'll go back. Don't worry, I'll go back on my own. Don't worry. They literally make it where you have to leave and they come back no matter what it looks like. Still trying to talk to everybody just in case. Go right back to her, or do I have to talk to the mom? Hopefully we don't have to talk to the mom. Don't worry, I go back to We have to talk to the mom. That sucks. Yeah, yeah. I feel like we just did this event. Now we're doing it again. Bye, thank you, yeah. Talk with you. Iron's back, you'll go. Don't much. Alright, yeah, my thanks. Go talk to the manager to pick up by them. Mr. Lloyd, package drive. Yeah, my thanks. I wonder what it is. Oh, beach boy. The Zealous. One ahead already. Oh, and they're quite some beauties. Beauties of what? Are you hunting for a shellfish or something? Lloyd, you're no fun. What? What are you talking about? Pickup artist. Ocean oh, excited. Mermaid. It's been a while since we've been in the ocean. I'm looking forward to it. Queen of the beach. Oh, where are the others? They're tired, so they're gonna rest in the rooms. Ah, they're no fun. All right, let's go to the beach. Hey, Lloyd. How oh, what? Over there, over there. Which one do you prefer? What? Which one do you prefer? Uh... Right one, I guess? I see. Then I'll take the left. Good luck to you, then. For what? Picking her up. You get friendly with her, then I'll rub oil on her body, and this is gonna be a very fulfilling vacation. Rub oil. Hey, what are you doing? Are you trying to pick up girls? Are you gonna try picking up girls looking like that? Oh, what are these cuties over here? Grape juice.
Alright, there you go with your sayings of stuff, and then Colette. Loy talking about her privates. Alright, so that was the beach blowout event. Don't know if there's anything else quite to do right now. Stay the night. And I may have needed to leave Altamira and come back in. Swimming at night. Good evening. Go to the casino and theater real quick. We're not gonna really gamble. We've already done. Got over a million chips with rain. his beloved. Outdoor theater. Can't climb up. Can't Go around this dude and go around her. Did I talk to you, dude? Little beauty. Mm, not listening. to her. Oh, I can talk to the dealers about gambling. Okay, I need to go back and do that. So I need to talk to you. Alright, what do you got? Spirit ring, strike ring, pellets. Forget me not. Devil's play thing. Awesome. What are we going to go? I can't wait to see. It's been really amazing. It costs that many chips. A hundred pigs or a hundred cows. Please tell me you're just Jeff Lloyd. What matter casino would offer a herd of swine for its highest price? No, I'm certain it's a true treasure. Like a full edition of the Fabuli Allegravum, the oldest manuscript known to man. Oh, he wants some dusty old book. Now, for a hundred and fifty thousand chip prize, a one day trial employment at the lovely Altamir Casino. Congratulations. Come again? You heard right, lucky sir. A one day trial employment at the very casino. Oh man, who cares about that? All those chips? And it buys us a chance to work for no pay? Look, I'll pass. Somebody else go. Well, perhaps I'm not a glamorous prize. It is exceptionally a rare one. Casinos are scarcely known for offering a glimpse behind the scenes. Very true, and there's something to be learned from every experience. It's possible such an undertaking could lead to new breakthroughs in my teaching methods. It sounds like we have a lucky winner. That be told, I'm relieved it's such a lovely lady. It saves us tailoring fees. Now, right this way.
All right, let's go kill some time till Professor's done. What's with all these people? Whoa, Professor, what are you wearing? Floyd, uh, this isn't... I didn't... The casino invites only the finest beauties to join his cast of honeys. The renowned the world over. But I absolutely insist that any trial employee here give it a try. Shame not to. Just looking at her absolutely stunning, isn't she? I never knew anyone could be that pretty. I lost my money here like I got a hole in my pocket, so I swore I'd stop coming after today. Forget that noise, I'm coming here every day of the week. Oh, sure, stare all you like. If I were five years younger, there wouldn't be a single eye on her. Oh, kind and generous God, I am not worthy of this botanist blessing. I shall take it as a sign for more souls must be saved right here. Shall remain as long as I must. Well, hello, gorgeous. You must be a teacher because I'm learning all sorts of new things right now. Maybe later I could arrange a, arrange a private lesson. I will light you on fire. You probably should, although he's right. You look really pretty, Professor. Stop it, all of you. Ah, Professor Rain. Yeah, it's a, uh, they even call it Nevermind Collect. Rand obtained the title of Chosen Beauty. Alright. That's all we needed. We're gonna go back to the hotel, go 5th, 4th, 3rd, 2nd floor, 1st floor, out the door. Hotel's another beast at night. This Jihani and I have work to do. This moves way too fast and it's kind of nauseating. It's only this one floor. You're charming, oh, tee hee. Cats, cats, cats. Yeah. We're gonna get to the old guy. Her. Oh, yeah, do you know anything about limits? Yes. Oh, then tell me that. Pew. Yeah. Meow yeah, meow. Yeah. Roar. Er. That one woofs. Never seen a cat wolf. All right, we talked to all the cats. Oh, that made it quick. That's everything for Altamira for right now. Uh, 
Um, let's see, where else do we need to go? We're gonna battle a few things. This is gonna be cake. Fire seal! Get him! Huh. <laughs> that was so easy! I'm trying to think, we need to go to South East Abbey. Probably need to go back to Flanor. This is gonna be cake. Fire seal! Uh, huh. Fire huh. seal! Not even a content. Alright. Bit of both of those. Bin of Misa is a uh, Flanor. We're in Heimdall. We're in Xir. We have not been back to the Fuji Mountain. We may check the base, see if there's anything. Alright, so yeah, we, we... I'm going the wrong way. We're going to go to the Southeast Abbey first. Just somewhere over here. Who else needs to check in on his sister? Once we finish up everything over here, we're going to have to go to uh, Silveront. Dude, let me through. What up, little sis? How's it going, my darling little sister? Big brother, I... Now don't do anything dangerous. Thank you. I appreciate your thoughts, but I, the Chosen, is doing all... This for my darling little sister, so relax and wait for my triumph return. Please take care. Oh, that's more for Lloyd than me. What do you mean by that? Hehehe, <laughs> don't get mad. As long as I'm around, everyone will be fine, right? Whatever. Get going. Thanks, Ellis. Huh? Big brother. I pray for your safe journey for now. Please be careful. Alright. I think Flanor will be the next place we go. Oh, we'll go see if we can stop at the Otherworldly Gate. I don't know if we can. Yeah, we can't. We're gonna go back to Flanor for a minute. Aw, oh, she gave me her beef strips. Ross is probably going to go rest in the hotel. Beloved, handsome. Charming now, now. Beautiful. Hey, the rooms look quaint. Cold, cold. Such a wimp, Lloyd. It doesn't matter if you're a wimp or not, it's still cold. Just don't think about it. 
After a while on the subject, how can you not be cold? You're wearing short sleeves and shorts. But now that you mentioned, I'm starting to feel really cold. See what you mean about thinking about it. Alright. Goal is to try to talk to everybody. Weapons armor. How do I not have all these? I swore I came through here and bought everything. Wow, I really did not. There goes a few million. Oh. Now yeah, success. Monsters you have not encountered are one. They missed one monster somewhere here. Hi, right, honey, are you? Uh Oh, she doesn't give us super pellets. Welcome. I already follow all your crap. You're cute. Play with me. Part of the church. Gave us her potato. I don't remember that woman being there. Doctor's still gone. Kind of surprised by that. I thought they would have been back by now. Alright. So, for right now, I think we are pretty well good to go on what's here. Let's go to the sil silver off. Wasn't trying to go to the base. Alright, so there are quite a few things to do here. Um, I want to go see Dirk. It's been a while since we've seen Dirk. Nothing new with Dirk. Oh my goodness, turn. The camera is fighting me every chance it gets. We're here to Martell Temple. There should be something here to do. I have to be.
this doesn't work, I'm gonna have to come back later. Alright, yeah, we'll have to come back later. Because there is a, uh, another thing going on there. Now to Zelia. Go talk to everyone real quick. Let's hole is still there. Such a lovely lady. Child, charming woman, future beauty. All right, here, let me heal you. In a careful. I'm really drawing a blank of who else to talk to as Zelos. Lovely lady. Charming. He fully rebuilt some of the stores buildings and then completely it did not even work on the others. Charming. Is there anything else over here? Oh, wait, what was that last thing? Yeah, we'll buy some eggs. Future honey. That raining genius's home got burnt down too. or something over here. There it is. Up in here real quick. House of Salvation. Wine. Trying to tie up all of our loose ends. the linket tree. Glad we're able to revive the linket tree. Pretty tree. Yeah. Been to try it. There really shouldn't be anything else. And there's the Uncle Mini game, but I'm not doing that right now.
We're gonna run through here. I'm gonna see if there's any people or if it's just monsters real quick. We're gonna shred any monsters. I'll talk, no action. You're in for a world of hurt. Fire seal! Fire seal! Fire seal! I'm a god! I'll talk. No, no action. action. You're in for a world of hurt. Fire seal! Ha! Fire seal! That was disappointing. Yeah, it was. All right, so there's nothing really over here. You're gonna regret this. Fire seal. <clears throat> fire seal. Ha, 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 ha. Fire seal. That's it. I was just getting started. Not much of a specimen. Fire uh, seal. Uh, uh, fire uh, seal. Uh, fire uh, seal. Uh, I'll talk. No action. There's action. There's definitely action. Alright, so that was nothing. That's the cat's village. Making sure there's nothing else out here, then we're gonna use the gold over here. Anything over here? Beautiful. We go in. Yeah, we'll spend the night. find her boyfriend maybe he came back this time we're not gonna let you get away favor stop how you get if you interfere we'll take you out too now it's not what you think professor please I know You're all right. They're all right. Can you hear me? Yes, yes. Thank you so much. I finally returned to my original form. Thank goodness. I'm so glad. What? 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 Why did a monster turn into a human? Are you stupid? She was a human to begin with. She was turned into a monster by the designs. How can I possibly thank you? I only have a vague memory of when I was a monster. But I still remember that you saved me in Palomacosta. Sorry, it's all my fault. Could have been stronger. No chosen. You even saved someone like me. Clara. I'll return to Paloma Costa. I don't think what I could possibly do, but I feel like there must be something. Please be well chosen. I pray for your success. I'll return to Paloma Costa. I do not know what I could possibly do, but I feel I must do something. Paloma Costa's gone.
future honey. Deep blue. Get some cod, some barley rice, seaweed. Dear, get a little beauty. He'll find him if you don't go away. Oh, she gave me her tomato. Oh my goodness, ladies. Yeah, Palomacos is gone, gone. Down this way, we're gonna walk to Lunin. Man, don't you guys fire seal? Thanks. Uh, fire seal. Ready? 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 No. Uh, fire seal. Fire seal. Uh, uh, there we that's go. it. How's this getting started? Fried rice. Just in case I missed anything, I'm doing the walk. So there is a long walk here. Not much of a specimen. Dire no! Fire seal! Fire seal! Edge! Ready? Fire seal! Ray! Top! No! <laughs> That was so easy! Let's see... Anything else along the path? We've done a huge journey coming all the way around. This is gonna be cake. We may run a Hema real it? quick because we're on a pass. Let's get started. It. This Hema is right here. Good to go. Let's stay one night just in case. Get some rare pellets. I don't know. What's up here right off the bat? Oh yeah, it's this woman we helped earlier. Success. There's one monster left in the region. Nothing else up here.
Alright, we'll walk to Luna in from here. You're gonna regret this! Uh, uh, higher uh, 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 Get him! Higher Ready, wave! Well, that dead. was disappointing. All right, here's Lunin. Oh, hey, you're new. Oh, sir, you have good taste. What? If you act now, I'll sell you this boat for only 3,000 gold. Well, you want to buy it? This is 3,000 gold? We can't be made out to sea with a boat like We can't even make it out to sea with a boat like this. It's called a houseboat. They're popular in Azul right now. I didn't see anything like this in Azul. Ah, oh, I mean, it's about to become popular. How about it? Future dream house. For my future? The place, a home where you can get all lovey dovey with a certain girl? Come on, buy it. Okay, I'll take it. Good boy, let's write up a contract right now. Okay, here, here's a contract, don't lose it. See you around, ha 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 ha. Boy, show me the contract. This is it, I knew he's trying to trick you. What is it? Look at this, it says it's a lease. You rented the boat for 3,000 gold from a person named Alfred. What? Isn't the Alfred the one Lila asked us to give a letter to? Hey, it can't be, that was Alfred, damn it. I must see him next time. That's well, our boat now. We gotta make sure we talk to everybody. Hi, right, cutie. Hee hee. Gotta talk to everybody. Beauty, making a blush. I have no idea where that dude went. We finally find the dude we were looking for. He gone. I wonder if I have to leave the whole town. Oh, she gave me her chicken. Step out. Come 
back in, see if we can find that dude. Shouldn't need to talk to anyone else. Oh, you're still there. I've been waiting for you, Lloyd. You, Alfred. Hey, you know my name. It's not important, you tricked us. Hey, it's your fault for not checking the contract. Indeed, contracts are absolute. Regal, whose side are you on? Okay, okay, fine, let's do this. Let's make a new contract. Come with me and adventure across the seven seas. What the heck are you talking about? Searching for the legendary treasure left behind by Spiritcha. If you help me find that, I'll give you the, the boat. Okay. Are you sure, Lloyd? You're going to get tricked again. Broken Vow number 18, it's better to be deceived than to deceive. I'm gonna try trusting him. Okay, then let's make the contract. Not again. This time I'll look at it as well. I don't see any problems. Okay, then I'll sign. Alright, then we got a contract. Time to go, crew. What are you talking about? Well, so from this point on, you're my crew. What, you're just gonna help us hunt for some treasure? That's why you guys are amateurs. Read the contract carefully. Hey, this contract is an application to become a pirate. Impossible. That was careless. It must have been double layered. Lloyd signed be becoming a pirate without realizing it. Aha, this is our contract. It is still. Now, crew, change out of those flashy clothes. What the? Why just me? Sorry, I'm low on funds. You'll have to represent all of us as a pirate. Wait, you got a problem? You know this outfit isn't half bad. Oh well, I think we'll just get along, Lloyd. Lloyd's taste in clothing is absolutely terrible. Lloyd obtained the title, Arg me hearties. Alright, begin the search at once. Search for where? Well, oh, search for anything related to the church or Martella from top to bottom. I'll be waiting for you in Hema. Are you gonna make us do all the work? Stop grumbling, my boat was damaged by a recent earthquake. Now listen, if you find any clues, come to Hema. Damn it, fine, we'll go look for him. Go check out the House of Salvation, okay, Lloyd? I guess that's all we can do. The Con Man. Damn the Alfred tricking us like this. He's quite the Con Man your fault too for falling for it. By that logic it sounds like you're saying that someone who gets robbed is more at fault than the guy who robbed him. I said two. Anyway, right, now that we've made a contract with him, we have to aid him in his treasure hunt. Man, what are we going to have to go through now? Alright. I know there's a, yeah, House of Salvation here. It's alright because we already needed to come here. The treasure of Spiritcha. The Ring of Spiritcha war on her first Pokemon which is very valuable. Now that you mention it, one of her descendants of the seven disciples of Spiritcha was on a pilgrimage. Being a descendant of the seven saints, he would most likely know about this treasure you speak of. He seems to be visiting the Houses of Salvation, so you may run into him eventually. I say the House of Salvation is pretty empty. I wonder if it's because both Asgard and Lunan are right nearby. You do still run. Hitting on you? Yeah. Giant tree. Let's see if anything new happens at the lake. Oh. I'm gonna go to the other house of salvation real quick.
a little bit more of a journey. There it is. A descendant of the seven saints? Oh, you mean High Priest Augusti. High Priest Augusti is a descendant of the seven saints. You know him. The priests all come to train under grandmother, so... Augusti said he was going to make an offering of the treasure passed down to the spiritual at the final lo location on this pilgrimage. Then he headed for the next house. Okay, so let's go. Chosen. Okay, everyone's upset about Palamacosta. There another Martel Temple, maybe. Alright, so I'm right there. There's a House of Salvation over there. There's that one. That one. We're gonna go to the one straight across from us, and then we'll try Martel Temple. Everybody's upset, we know. Oh, what's going on? Since the Chosen went on our journey, instead of getting better, the city got destroyed. When will Marte awake and save us? Martel saves those who walk on their own two legs. Go awaken her. I'm tired of hearing that speech. I want my son back. Oh, Chosen, please give my son back. Palamacosto was destroyed by that monster. My son was. My son was. I, I can't. If you're the Chosen, you can do something. Go meet Martel and have her bring my son back to life. Are you saying you can't even do that? You're a failure, just like they say. Stop. My son is dead. He died believing the world was about to be regenerated. This is too cruel. Chosen, I apologize. No, it's my fault. Because I couldn't save the world. It's not over yet. Our journey is not over. Plan us, we haven't abandoned this one. Yes, we believe in you. By the way, what brings you here today? We're looking for someone named Augusti, who has the treasure of spirit show. My priestess Augusti is at the House of Salvation by Thoda Island Dock. Boat Dock. He asked to uh, conduct prayers by someone named Alfred. Alfred? Lloyd, let's go. Yeah. Alright, so we got a clue. Go to Island Dog. Alright, where are we? We are over here. Are you over here by any chance? Possibly. Oh, are you the Chosen? Yes. During the recent disaster, many people lost their lives. Even those that survived are filled with despair because of the disappearance of Tower of Salvation. Yes. I want a journey to appease those who lost lives and guide those who survived towards hope. And while on that journey, I met a man, Alfred. Yes, he was seeking the treasure of spiritual in order to benefit those who were unsatisfied. It's a complete lack of progress in world regeneration. However, along the way, a great disaster occurred. His boat was destroyed and all his companions were lost at sea. He asked me to pray for them, for those who have believed in world regeneration and in the future. What can I, what can I do? It's true that I have failed, but still there is a path. We're searching for a way to save everyone. All you can do is what you are able to do, and you have been regenerated. 
Think back to all those who have lost their lives. Yes. If we just stay here in the land, the situation will only worsen. I'm sure it's painful for you, but people must keep looking forward. Yes. Please give this to Alfred. Spiritual's ring. This is the ring to be Spiritual's greatest treasure. Alfred said he wanted me to find the chosen and have you pray for his companions. At the end of the pilgrimage, inform you that the meaning behind this pilgrimage. They're saying, I'll go meet with Alfred. Chosen, I'm counting on you. Please take care of Alfred and the world. The. I talked to you? Yeah, I did. We'll come talk to you in a second, lady. Fuck. What was that? You said the geyser got destroyed? Though the island was destroyed too. Ooh, I did not know that. Oh wow, it really is. Sometimes I think there is no such thing as a world where no one is sacrificed. It's too idealistic. Oh, you're probably right. Then what are we doing is ideals are absolute. In reality, people are unable to live without sacrifices. Or even sacrifices in something as simple as consuming food. Maybe it's impossible, but I still don't want a world that would accept the fact that someone is going to suffer. Do not think too broadly. Even if someone is sacrificed, there is still meaning in being kind to others. For instance, you greet your friend with a smile in the morning. That might ease a friend's mind if they're anxious about something. Yeah, you're right. I guess I should try to make the world perfectly peaceful at once. You don't know what will make each person happy, but we cannot allow a system that ignores the voice of some. This is how I feel. You're really mature. Yeah, it's probably your influence. Mine? Your pure viewpoint has probably rubbed off on me. I didn't know you could eat, actually come up here, so kind of curious. You're gonna regret this. Higher seal. Uh, huh? Higher seal. Uh, Get him. Ready? Higher Gravity seal. well. Higher. I'll talk. No action. Oh, he's real in a while. All right. So he is going to be in Hema. I also wanted to run down to Paloma Coaster real quick. Okay. There's absolutely nothing he could do there. Hema? Hema? You're literally gonna make me walk the few steps. We gotta check up here just in case he's up here. And he is. Did you hear the story chosen? I, because of my incompetence, I apologize. You don't need to apologize to me, I am alive. If you're going to apologize, apologize to my dead crew. Yes. Alfred, this may sound like an excuse, but please listen. Let Dan abandon Silveron. We just... Don't say anything that doesn't just sound like an excuse. It is an excuse. I just want the Chosen to go on a pilgrimage for my crew. Yes. I'm sure all worked hard for world regeneration. I know that, but I understand the feelings of those who blame you. Yes, it betrayed their expectations. As long as you understand that, then it's fine. There's still a path towards world regeneration, right? Yes, that's why we're on this journey, searching for a better way. Good. 
Relieved to hear that. I'll dispose of the contract. You can now use the bow and loon as you please. Same goes for the spiritual ring. What are you going to do? I think I'll get a bow and look for a new island that's not on any map. Oh, hey, Lloyd. We have that letter, remember? Oh, yeah, Alfred. We have a letter for you. This, this is... Layla's been looking for you for a while. You two must be close. Oh, no. Hey, will you take this to Layla for me? Why Layla for me? Acquired Alfred's letter. What? Well, give it to her yourself. Shut up. I have my reasons. I'm counting on you later. Oh, brother, fine. Let's go back to Izzolu. The journey of world regeneration involves us delivering mail. Not that one. I think it's this one. What? You have a letter from Alfred. What? Just what do you think you're up to? Oh, what are you talking about? Read this letter. Julia, I'm sorry, but I'm able to return you the money I borrowed by the due date. I am going on a new journey. My first mate, Lloyd, who delivered you this letter will pay off all the money I owe you. Thank you for all you've done for me. Farewell. All right, pay me back the money. Hey, 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 girl. All right, you this Alfred guy's girlfriend? You gotta be kidding, I never date a bandit like that. I'm a money lender. Said he's gonna find the legendary treasure of Mythos or something. And he ran off after borrowing money from me. Um, by the way, how much does he owe you? 100 million in gout with interest. 100 million. I give it back. We don't have that kind of money. We'll give you Spiritus treasure instead. Those it might have some value to a collector. I know, how about selling it to the Koton? Yeah, Layla, wait just a little bit. We're gonna make some money. Alright. Is it true that a letter came from Alfred? Then take Max with you. What? Can't let you run away. Give the money to Max. I don't quite understand, but okay. Now hurry up and make that money. Okay, we're heading out to Hannah's so Peak. What, you want me to buy this from you? Huh, the string was worn by Spiritual. Alright, how much? 100 million. That's ridiculous, I can't pay that. Well then we'll just throw this Spiritual's ring into the sea. What? We're leaving now, Lloyd. Alright, alright. Well, 100 million gal is too much for just that. There's something else on that price that match. Alright, how about we give you a red pass? What? You're the one who is selling these for 100 million gold, so it's worth it, right? Sure, take it. I'm nervous holding to that much money. What if I drop it? Don't worry, just take it. Okay. Okay, now we can pay uh, her back. We can tell Leia. Hey, right, here's the 100 million gold. Welcome back, my 100 million gold. Oh, and you too, Max. I received your payment with this. I'll mark your debt as paid. Hope you learn from this never to trust a calendar like that again. Uh, if you want to borrow money, stop by any time. A lot of freaking money. Oh, they were in love. No, nah, she's a loan shark. I don't remember that lady. Alright. So... We've done quite a bit. We want to go to Asgard next. Dude, just land. Hi, kitty. Vortex in. Yeah, we'll stay. Lloyd, that outfit. 
Oh, genius. Take a picture. I look just like a pirate. You know, the seas of the world are mine. They are the homeland I forever longed for. Wow, Lloyd, you're so cool. Yeah, isn't it, though? I'm a pirate captain. You, yo ho ho. I don't know about a captain. More like deckhand. Please take care. Change back. Hi, cutie. Hello. Want to make sure that I am doing this right. I'll be so upset if we do not get the thing for talking to every lady. soon though we won't have anything else we have to like cook or anything for with a bunch of these characters with your sons. What'd you give me? They gave me something, but I don't know what it was. Beauty. Yeah, Della is hitting on the dude's wife. He's a hound dog. Gave me her bread. Cool breeze. Ah. Uh. All right, all of them are done. to you, go back up to the dais, Armadeus. Oh, Rain. Oh, Aishu, what's wrong? I'm so glad I found you. I've been searching forever. For me? Yes, would you please come see the mayor? All right. Oh, Rain, good timing. What is it? First, who saw you perform the ritual on the stone dais. They are demanding we show it to them again. Would you please step upon the dais as an acolyte? Huh. Come on, Professor, do it. Yes, I'd like to see it too. And those of us from Tetheola have only heard about it. How about it? Show us your beautiful form, Rain. Alright, but just this once. Thank you, let us go to the dais at once. Oh, 
Oh, so Nakla is so beautiful. Yeah, I think I'm gonna be her fan. Arane, you're such a wonderful person. Oh, she's got more fans. It's because they don't really know what she's like. Rain obtained the title Maiden. Beautiful sight. See, the whole world has opened up. Now it's just a matter of finding everything. I don't want a room. I do want to go into all your rooms. Bottle. Captain Beauty flattered, orange gel. to the completion of that book. Oh, I should go to Dirk's house to see if he can make any more uh, collectibles. I don't know if I've encountered anything new. Professor Nova, Honestow Peak. Like Stuck Boy? I realized something recently. They made against the rules to hide inside the building. That's realized something, yeah. And get out there and be with your friends. You're literally making your little friend cry. Talk to everyone here. We should see if Dirt can make anything else with the pellets. They've also gotten a few references to Hamaso Peak, so maybe we should go to that too. Hamaso Peak should only take a moment. Dirt should only... It's a little ways away, but it should only take a moment too. the collectors we're close we're really close with the collectors guide all right we need to go visit dirt
Process pellets. Okay, teleprocessing, sure, just a moment. Make anything new. Sorry, I can't do anything with these pellets. Alright. Well. And then we'll, uh, go to the great battlefield of Carlon. Or Tower of Carlon. I think I actually have to be Sheena for this now. Alright, it's not wanting to pop, that's odd. We're gonna go quickly visit every area. We're gonna re-talk to everyone real quick. No, we can. Hey, nice to meet you. Don't care. Princess. Trying to talk to all female characters as Zelos, if we can. Some of these, it's hard to tell if they're male or female. Aw, she gave us her beef. We talked to all the dogs. back here. A charming lady killer. Alright. We're gonna just plow through as many of these towns as we can real quick. Never Gonna see what we see. You gonna heal me? Alright. So from Azalea, travel, travel the world. that way. There should be a house of salvation. The pepperoni. She gave us her pasta. Everyone loves a good pasta. Alright. That takes us back up north. Don't want to go up north. Uh, where is the trees back this way? Alright, so we need to go to Trident. 
real quick. Do not want to play the uncle game. Now we have to run into the building. But all the monsters unique in this region. Excuse me, beautiful. He <laughs> hello. I just find it funny how creepy Zelos is. He will be cancelled in our current culture. like it. Does it force me back to Lloyd? It does. Alright. Talk to all the female based characters here. Back here to the tree just in case anything happens. I don't think anything will. Look at tree, it's pretty, yep. Alright, over the mountains, through the woods, to the little village over here. Hi, beautiful. Success. Looks like you got all the treasure chests. Cool. Basically, getting ready to head into some final battles. Not fully the final battle, but we're in like the last few chapters of this game. Just wanted to make sure that we talked to everyone that we can. Really praying that we did not miss anyone. Silver Aunt. Sad that we don't get to rebuild Paloma Costa. Ah, oh, there wasn't anything between Layla and Alfred after all. Thanks, guys. Why are you thinking us? We didn't do anything. Now Layla will surely look at me. Here's a token of my thanks. Alfred's hat. Really grateful to you. Thank you so much. That's cool. Didn't know that was even a thing. 
future, honey. Ah, get away. Freaking zealous acting like P. Diddy over here. This way. I know we have to go back to Cat's Village, but I know there's no additional cats. Nice to meet you. Again. Nothing new. Yeah, super pellets. Our salvation disappeared because Crucius. That's because I don't know if we got them all here. Nothing else up here. Hema is checked off our list. So Lunin should be next. Wherever it is this way. Don't worry, leave it to me. Uh, <laughs> uh, pull off. Ice tornado. Really? Hey, not I'll talk, no action. All of us are poisoned. You're in for a world of hurt. Yep. I don't ever remember those creatures. That was not the right thing. Not too bad. Uh, that freezes enemies. I so said that is something different. Here. Lunan's a big city, so this may take a minute. Charming lady. Hi, cutie. Uh, finished delivery. Did it. Nothing's going on on my boat. Beautiful. Somebody. Yeah, you don't like high places, but you climb high places. Alright, off to the church. Thank you. 
Alright. Back to this lady. One last section of Lunin to go. Yeah, you like Sheena, your child. A lot of people in here. Check there's no one back here. Do your best. I don't think there's any items to recover, but you know, you can't help but go look. Start upstairs and go downstairs. Hello, lovely lady. All right, that was Lunin. So, I know the Barcliff area here got destroyed. I think that's where we're going to, or is this the Tower of Mana? I don't know if there's anybody we can talk to here. I don't care for pointless battles. That's so annoying! Get him! Gravity well! Can't even use that, ah. Not too bad. All talk, no action. Alright. I know that's not a thing. And... Equipment. Oh well, that does. I don't care for pointless. Battles. Fire seal! Fire seal! Gotcha. Burn! Fire seal! Raging mist! Fire seal! Not too All talk, no act. Did we have not got one curry cooked correctly? Like, what is your? Yeah, Misa stew. All right, this should be the blown up base. There shouldn't be anybody here, but I'm gonna walk over here. Yeah. Here comes more of them. Fire seal. <laughs> Fire <laughs> seal. <Infinite> power. Grant <laughs> me Fire my seal. Seal. <laughs> Fire seal. Meteor storm. <laughs> Seal. All talk, no action. He says to. There shouldn't be anyone else at the unicorn. We'll go back to the unicorn. We're basically just marking the crap off our list right now, real quick. Oh, there's another House of Salvation.
Yeah, everything is either destroyed or gone. Asgard's the last real big city in this world to see. City, uh, world. See, we need to go this way. This one will take us a hot minute because it's so big. Hello? Patty? Howdy, young lady. Miss. Sir. Bring me back to the Red Dead Redemption times. Ma'am, sir. Gotta purchase all of our food ingredients. Sir, sir, ma'am, sir. I don't think you have anything I need. I don't think you have anything I need. It says, looks like you already got all the treasure chests. They get all the monsters. I'm assuming they did. Yeah, 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 some peak. Whirlwind. Ma'am. Sir. Little, little miss. Other miss. Sir, ma'am. Miss. Hee hee. Out the door, Zelos, out the door. We all want to walk the dinosaur. Little sir. Dragon guy. I'll go up to the dais. I don't think there's... I think there's just one dude running around, yeah. No, I don't want a super expensive room. Imagine sharing a room with four random strangers. That would be odd.
sir. Yeah, you should be cooking. Little beauty. Ah, oh, he wants to make beautiful memories with her. Lady. Other lady. Gave us her cod. We couldn't hold it. What kind of world is it where you can't hold your cod? Yeah. I don't know if we'll get the figurines book all complete of this playthrough or not. We'll see. We're trying. Future honey. Can't find Pete. Oh my goodness, Pete. Realize some reason. I think it may be against the rules to hide inside a building. Yeah. Cheater. Right, nothing else up here. Alright, last one. Last house, that is. Beauty, don't tell the madam. Don't tease your elders. No cutie. Alright, well, that was Asgard. City of something. I think wind. City of windy farts. Go through the pass. Peak. One of you is not a woman, is it? Not I. Right. Yeah. Not oh, meant to talk to that guy. I haven't released all the cells. Released most of the cells. That dude's gone. That is odd. Um, go back in there, see if he's there now. Legitly, a person disappeared. That's not fun. Alright. Can't remember if there's something... This way still to go do. No, that's where the tower... Previous tower was. Yeah, you're gone. think there was another village or anything over here. No, but there's another talking point. Regal. What's on your mind? I get I was just thinking about the funds necessary if the world is indeed saved. Oh yeah, just because we defeat Crucix doesn't mean that's the end. Reconstruction is vital, but we have to cooperate with a large organization. That can handle such a grand project. A larger organization, like the Renegades? No, a political organization. 
kind of political system governs Silveron? I see. A long time ago, I heard there was a kingdom in Palamacosta. That was before there was a king in Asgard. Huh. The designs managed to destroy political organizations as well. So there's no one who can take charge of reconstruction. Katiala has his highness, but in Silveron it would be difficult. But that's really amazing that you think about things like that. I've been taught to think this way ever since I was young. Alright. You guys don't need to be all up on me. You're gonna regret Power this! Seal. Uh... You... We want... Here. We're back. <laughs> Too bad. Fire seal. That's it? I was just getting started. That ain't made me so stupid. We're walking because we want to see if we miss any chests or any talk points. Which we very well may have. Worry. Leave it to me. A basilisk. Fire, <laughs> get him. Fireball. That was disappointing. All right. So this was the monument to be able to use Noshi. I don't care for pointless battles. <laughs> fire seal! Want a charge? Fire seal! Thunderblade! Fire seal! That's it? I was just getting started. A lot of these battles are gonna be pointless until we get to the end battles. We're just looking around right now. Trying to make sure that we've achieved and done most of the side quests. You're gonna regret Those are different. Disappointing. You got a Mizuho potion and Silveron. That's different. I know for a fact we've talked to all the cats. Don't worry. Leave it to me. Fire, uh, fire <laughs> seal. That's it? I was just getting... I really don't. Oh, see, we missed that. Energy tablets. There we go. With all of those. Going to Cat's Village. Do, 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 do. I love the music in here. Yeah. Meow, 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 meow. Says, looks like you got all the treasure chests, the areas you've been to. Do a monster check for me. But I can't talk to that one up there. I do not want to talk to the elder. I know for a fact we've talked to him multiple times.
Alright. Can't go back to that one. Palamacosta is completely gone. There's like legitimately no reason to ever come back to this little southern part of the continent. This area is completely gone. This area we could go to, but there's like nothing to do here. I think we could go back in now. As far as we can go. There's one house of salvation over here. Like the only building still standing on this whole part of the continent. Alright. Talk to you. Talk to you. No. All right, it's Tetheala time. And we're flying, we're flying. Do 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 do. We did all we want to do in Silver Hunt for now. Wrong one. Yes, go to Tetheala, don't go to the base. All right. We need to go to... Tower of Salvation. Before we do Tower of Salvation, we are going to Reset up our equipment. All right. Got a demon seal. Yeah, we're gonna get rid of that. I'm gonna give you guys a bunch of random things. Maybe we should land first.
Let's go on to the Tower of Salvation. The Holy Land of Carlon. Not oh, good, it's blocked. This way, our escape route will be blocked. Here comes some more. Lloyd, this way. Lloyd, let's go. Why are you helping us? Now that the truth about me is known to you, Drassiel, the only way left to save Martell is to work with you. Don't think about what anything. Don't think that I want to be your friend or anything. You have a real negative attitude, you know that? Well, whatever. Thanks for helping us. Let's go, everyone. Shops. You might as well buy all these bottles while we're here. Dangerous this way. I thought that was where we were supposed to go. Leave this to me. Leave it to you? What are you gonna do? I figured something like this might happen, so I prepared a little something the last time we were here. Colette, come here for a second. Huh? Oh, okay. Good work, Chosen. Now, bring her to me. Sure thing. What the hell are you doing? Oh, shut up. I'm just putting myself on the winning side. What you're trying to do is hopeless and meaningless. What's the big deal? Colette wanted to be a sacrifice, remember? Zelos, you traitor! Oh, give it a rest, Lloyd. Did you forget what I said in Flanor? I side with the strongest. Betray you? How amusing. Zelos was our spy from the very beginning. Isn't that right, Zelos? Is that true? It's not true, is it? Please say that she's lying. I side with the strongest. It was a simple matter of weighing the renegades, Crucius, and all of you. You were leaking information to the renegades too? I can't believe you! You were always a pervert, but I never doubted that you were a good person when it came down to it. Why, thank you, my sweet voluptuous honey. But in the end, I choose this side, because Mythos promised to release me from my fate as a Chosen of Mana. You hate being the Chosen so much that you would betray your friends? Oh yeah, I do. It's because of that title that my life has been a total joke. I can't stand it. I can't wait for Celeste to become the Chosen instead. You're lying. I still trust you, you hear me? You're the one that told me I could trust you. What are you, stupid? Let's get going, Lady Pronima. Lloyd! 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 Disappear unto nothingness. Everyone! What are you doing here? We'll explain later. Here they come! Damn! Regroup! Reorganize the party. Alright. I'm guessing it wants Lloyd. I'd rather put Sheena here. Regal. Yeah, that should be good. We want to put Sheena. Earth, Regal, Killer. I will bid you for good! 
put a man's voice on the woman. Understood. Here, they I did not think that we would just one shot that person. Be Dang. So powerful. Here. Yeah. How can this happen? All right. He says, "Do." Are you okay? Yes. Why are you all here? We received a message saying that you were about to head to the final battle. Right now, you must hurry and save Colette. Right. Be careful. And you as well. Is it still active? Looks like it. Let's go. Zealous' betrayal. Did we really think about the true meaning of things Zillow said. What? Are you saying we should have been suspicious to every single thing he said just in case they sounded as the words of a traitor? No, I mean, I think maybe he never realized the true feelings behind the way he joked around all the time. I see what you mean. It's too late now, though. Yeah, before it came to this, we should have paid a little more attention to him. New save. An omelet. Man, there's a lot of them. Burn! Sword so rage. Like. I think he has killed every single thing. I'll talk. No action. Hurry. What we're doing this quest is we've got to hurry. Uh, what the heck? There's a door. Locked door. Jacked up wall. I don't care for pointless. Evil Orchard. It's bad. Here! Uh, no no way! Sword range! Uh, uh, get up! Sword Beast. range! Beast! Sword! Alright! Cucumber. And we made an omelet. Remnants of the giant tree. Well, it's another tree room. Yeah, I'm getting tired of these things. Have you forgotten this is where the giant tree was? These must be remnants of it. Oh, then these things. You don't need to worry, they don't have that kind of power left. But there is one with power left alive. Plants can really be hard to kill. Just leave that to me. Okay, we're counting on you. Doesn't work. Priorities. I need to discuss something with you. With me. Because you look like the most rational member of this group. We're heading into great danger. We need to decide in advance on whose lives are priority. I see. That sort of discussion would likely anger Lloyd. Lloyd, we must protect no matter what. The focus that we can hope to challenge Mythos' inhuman power is... Lloyd's special exosphere. Yes, I don't know what kind of power it really holds, but we must bet on the course coming with the highest odds of winning. Understood. Let us do what we must to protect Lloyd. Uh. This place is huge. Yeah, I can see that this goes down. That was startling. It appears this floor is only supported in the center. Tilts because of our weight. If only we could find something to weigh it down with. And how about we split into two groups and have one group 
become the way. How do you plan to join up again? We should think of another way. What is it, Persea? That. I see, it does look like that would work. Venus's apprehension. My heart is pounding for some reason. What's wrong? I guess I'm apprehensive. I don't know why. Everyone's here with me and all. Baseless apprehension is meaningless. Let's do our best, Genus. True, sure, after what we're supposed to do as zealous, you do kind of have to worry a little. It'll be okay. When we push comes to shove, we have to work together. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Diamond Shell. Alright, so this takes us up again. Nothing here takes us across. That's busted. Can't go that way. Nothing over there. Let's see if numbers it's will annoying. make up for their lack of strength. Demonic right. Understood. Get him! Dreaded way! Ancient <laughs> ruler of the elements! I summon thee! Come, Maxwell! Think you can avoid this? Get him! Aqua Head! Uh, 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 too bad! Uh, uh, sword Ring! Don't bother me! Alright! Well, there we go. Almost maxed out Alma. This is gonna be a piece of cake! Yeah, these are stronger. Doing nothing to it. Oh, there it goes. Ogre Axe. Some sort of staff. Southern Cross. A steak. This is going to be a piece of cake. <laughs> Not a trace. <laughs> Understood. Come get some. <laughs> Air thrust. <laughs> Power Tempest. Video. Thrust. <laughs> Tempest. Thrust. <laughs> That's it. How's this? It is indeed it. Doors open now. Get 
rid of the root. The root of all our problems. Man, don't you guys laugh? Uh, burn! Somebody power seal! Raging mist! Uh, not too bad. Sword rain! I was just warming up. And we got a steak. It's been so long since I've had a steak. Don't really remember what it tastes like. This is before COVID. Energy tablets. There's too many of them. Beast, get them. Sword ring. Like that? Purpose? No way. I was just warming up. Okay, this area is huge. Reinforcements, huh? I want to look around Beast? before I go to the new area. Oh, Understood. <laughs> All right. Like nothing over there. You chess. Star mail. Items. AC gem level four. Okay, there's nothing over there. Phoenix cloak. Burn. I can't go down, can I? I have to literally walk all the way around. I do. That's annoying. Time to backtrack. You're in for a world of hurt. How do you get him? Whizzling. No way. Trying to get sword. All right. We're gonna make a lot of food on the way back. I'm sure. I'll battle ya. More battles? Beast? <laughs> Beast? Sword rain! Like Burn. that? Understood. Beast? Raging Sword mist. rain! All talk, no action. How many of you are there? Beast? Sword <laughs> rain! Like that? Understood. Not a chance. All right. Alright, we finished our steak. Now it's quiche time. Um, wait a sec. I don't care for pointless battles. <laughs> Beast <laughs> not Sword rain! Right right Get him! Beast red and Sword rain! All talk, no action. I think it's this way. More battles? Ah, ah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Like yeah. that? Mirage see. That was disappointing. Yep. Let's see if numbers will make up for their lack Beast. of strength. Sword rain. Ah. Like that? That's it? How's this getting started? Another quiche. All right, wait a sec. So now, can't jump it.
go around it. Star Guard. There's a warp. Alright, Keish is there. What's going on? That's a lot of angels. Angels! Here they come. You're in for a world of... Hurt here! Sword rain! Sword rain! Beast! Sword rain! Beast! Sword rain! Beast! Sword rain! Gravity well! Sword rain! Beast! Sword rain! Beast! Sword rain! Serpent seal! Pick him! Away! Get him! Gravity well! How can this happen? Beast! Sword rain! How can this happen? That was disappointing. Yeah, it was. Damn it! There's no end in sight! Make a break for that passage. Alright. Regal! I'll hold them off here. Hurry! You know I can't leave you behind! There's no time. You know that. You're the only one who can save Colette. I know that, but I can't just leave my friend. That's not what you're doing. I... I once wasn't able to protect someone very important to me. So this time, I'm going to succeed. I'm going to protect my friends. Regal! Lloyd, save Colette. All right. Regal, don't die. Don't make me go through the same pain you did. You hear me? <laughs> you sure don't make things easy, Lloyd. I'm sorry, Alicia. It looks like it's still going to be a while before I join you. You shall not pass! Okay, wait a second. Broke, not broken. There's too many of them. Beast, sword rain. Beast, sword, sword, sword rain. Like that. Hey, Beast, not too bad. sword rain. No Beast, way. Sword rain. That was disappointing. Honestly, I would like to swap out for Saya and Rain, because I like having Rain in the party. Rain and then Sheena are my top two favorite characters. This is going to be a piece of... Towards the mid okay, archer. Here. Die! Be gone! How can this happen? Like that? How can this happen? Function. That's it? How's this getting started? Man, there's a lot of them! There's none of them yet. There we go. Sword ray! The kill of figures remind me of Final Fantasy. That was just warming up. Which I am highly considering doing Final Fantasy on the channel. If people would be interested. I love some Final Fantasy.
There we go. Alright. Got all these items. Time to move forward. Oh my goodness, the camera angle is so bad. We're actually going to call it an episode there. So on the next episode, we're going to continue. So thanks for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe. Share the video. And tell me what you think in the comment section down below. See you guys on the next episode. Have a wonderful day. God bless.